What's up guys, how's it going? Emperor here. So I'm just read great tweets called Reach App for iOS 8 or any phone that has reachability. And it's an amazing tweak, it's only available on this repo, so it's going to be showing off to the side. And it's a really great tweak, it just allows split screen multitasking. And if you have Windows 8 on Microsoft, it's just like the same thing, you can just do multiple things at the same time. And to first get into it, I'm just going to show you how it looks first, then show you the settings of it. So let's just go in the settings here and what you have to do to enable reachability is that just double tap, don't double press, just double tap on the home button and it brings up all the things that you can choose from the recent apps you've chosen, the favorites and the all apps and let's just pick like Google and it just picked all the apps I had already. And if you want to just resize the thing already, there's a bottom grabber right here where you can just resize what screen you want available. And you can just type up anything you want from here, just like you're using the Google app, but you're using two things at a time. It works on both apps. It's a really great, it's a really great tweak. I just wanted to show that. And then just to dismiss it, all you have to do is just let me double tap again. All you have to do is just double tap on the home screen again or home button again and just dismisses the reachability. And it's a really great tweak. Now I'm gonna be showing the settings of it. In the Reach app, there's a first the kill switch, the enable, disable, and that's pretty easy to know or to use. Then there's the show notification center instead of the app. So it just shows the notification center instead of showing all the apps that you have already open. Then there's a disable, all or dismiss, and it just disables the default duration that reachability closes after. And reachability just closes after a limited amount of time. And this just disables that so you can have it open until you switch it off. There's a, then there's the enable rotation and it just forces apps to rotate to the current orientation like portrait or landscape so it just forces the app to rotate there so you don't have to rotate your phone either way then there's the home button closes reachability and instead of the home button just uh, going closing reachability and then going to your home screen this just closes reachability and just makes it easier easier for you to just keep what you have on already instead of just going to the home screen and then going back then there's a show bottom grabber and that's the thing right here that I'm moving up and down right now that's the thing it just resizes the screen up top and down and it just shows that so you can actually use it let me just go back then there's an instantly resize and just instantly resizes the app when you're using the dragger or you can just wait until you're done dragging and just instantly resizes the app for whatever you want then there's a show app selector and it just shows an app chooser similar to the ios at ios 6 app switcher in the reachability view it's just like ios 6 i'm i'm sure most of you already know it and this just looks just like ios 6 it just shows the running apps already um showing or using so any running apps you already have like i already have google it's already there let me go back they can also auto size the app chooser and you can just auto size the app chooser to the size of the available apps so it just it's really self-explanatory just auto size the app chooser then the three things down here is the favorites you can choose what favorites you want i chose in the safari piano tiles photos and it puts them up here in the reach app uh, settings here it just puts my favorites piano ties photos phone and safari and you can see here it's already here i can just choose it right there instead of just scrolling through all my apps and then choosing it then there's a show all apps and instead of you just choosing favorites you can just show every app you want there so instead of just going through everything it just shows all the apps already there and then this is just the beta mode and you it just uses scaling rotation mode you don't really need to use it but uh if you want to it's you're free to anytime it's a really great tweak it's only available in this repo in the side and i really should get it once again it's called reach app it is for free so that's one more reason for you to get it so that's it for today if you like this video please like and below and please subscribe and i'll see you later